Hey guys, so I'm in a sassy mood. So this is gonna be a good video. So get ready for this, buckle up. Like up, subscribe, great bell. If you do, you get a kiss. Okay, you guys, let's talk about Rylan Adams. I wanna discuss why you guys think he hasn't called out Jeffree Star because, okay, first of all, some, okay, I've had trouble sleeping the last couple nights. And someone suggested, girl, if you wanna sleep, like a real deep sleep, watch one of Rylan Adams' podcasts. It'll put you to sleep like that. And I'm like, good idea. So I watched a few minutes. Girl, I was ugh, I was out like a light. It was so boring. Him and that Lizzie girl, the redhead or whatever her name is, Izzy Lizzie. I'm going to call her Miss Boring because that's what, that's what she is, Miss Irrelevant. Um, so their podcast. And I was like, what can I do to make this podcast more interesting? This is what Rylan can do. Rylan, listen up. This is some good advice. Take notes, girl. Um... He should do two episodes back to back. The first episode, he should unfollow Jeffree Star. Why not? He should have done it anyway. I mean, he pretty much ruined his career. At, well, their careers at this point, or enabled everything. Um, and then he should talk about why he unfollowed Jeffree Star on his podcast the next day. And he should be like, and go off on Jeffree Star, like go white boy crazy, be like, go for look, go on him, be like, Jeffree Star said this and did this, and this is how he is behind the scenes. And, uh, go off that episode will get millions of views for sure and then the next week you know what you should do oh, see, I had a good idea and I forgot it I just forgot it oh whatever oh, anyway the next episode Morgan can come on there as a guest host again and then she can bitch him out and they can just go back and forth and bitch a bunch about Jeffrey Now, that'd be good. There was something else I wanted to say. Damn it. See, this is why I should take notes before I do these videos. Because there's another good idea I had just now and I forgot it. Anyway, whatever. I'll think about it later. But anyway, so that's what he should do. It's 11 up, up the podcast. He should just go off on him and, you know, call it a day. Oh, okay. Here's my idea. And then the week after that, he should talk about what it's like being a sugar baby because he would know all about it, honey. What is it like to marry some, to be engaged to somebody just for their money? I told you I'm in a sassy mood tonight. Oh my girl, whatever. So he should be like, he should call, he should call the next podcast Sugar Baby 101. How to get a sugar daddy and pretend that it's for love. Oh, you see, I'm going in right now. So that's what he should do. And he should be like, hey guys, this is how you snatch a daddy. This is how you get a daddy. Keep a daddy. Um, and just, yeah. I was thinking, why aren't they married yet? Why haven't they gotten married? Because they can just do a courthouse thing really quick. And then after COVID's over, they can have their big celebration about all their friends. Oh, wait a minute. They don't have any friends. Who are they going to invite to their wedding? Shane and Rylan. Are they going to invite Andrew? Nope. Drew? No. Garrett? No. Trisha? No. You know, Jeffrey ain't gonna show up because he's done with that. He's distancing them himself. So, Morgan, girl, she's too busy starting over her new life away from talk free people. So, who are they gonna invite to their wedding? Exactly. Nobody! Because nobody gives a fuck about them or their wedding. Or the sip, whatever it's called. And by the way, why do you call your, your podcast the sip? It's, what, what are you sipping? There's like no tea. It's like dry. You should call it empty because the cup is empty. There's no, there's no tea in your, in your, in your podcast. It's boring. It's make, good, good for ASMR channel. It puts me to sleep really good. Girl, I'm told, I'm in a sassy mood tonight. So I was like, you know what? Might as well film. I want to give you guys a juicy video. It's, it's been a hot minute. It's been this sassy film. I thought I'd give you guys a little sass tonight. Okay, girl. Hope you enjoy that tea and that sass. I always give you the tea. If you want tea, girl, like up, subscribe, and great bell. You always get hot tea here. And I serve my tea real hot. Oh, and I always keep 1,000 with you guys. Always. Like, rate, bell, subscribe. Savers and fabulous. Kisses. Until next time. Bye, guys.